unchanged from the team that won in Philly on the final day of the regular season. The headline, Luca Orejano and Yuya Kubo in that forward line of two. Also linking up with Sands, Parks, and Perea, making sure they're connected tight as a unit. And that connectivity should allow the front three to do what they do. For FC Cincinnati, winners of the Supporter Shield a year ago, got to the Eastern Conference Final, lost an extra time to Columbus Crew as they're underway with round one from Cincinnati as FC Cincinnati play host. Tough for those center forwards to win those long balls. Not a ton of height in there as Kubo carries on. Here's Yuya Kubo! Just dragged wide of target. Did well to get a clean strike away, but just the wrong side of the post. Now Cincinnati want to get going on the break. Luca Arishano spotting that big switch is on towards Lucho Acosta. Followed into Kubo and left for Acosta. This is where he loves to operate his strike, though, a team effort. And well handled there by Freeze. And it's going to be a yellow card. Gray into Perea. Uses his frame to ward off any challenges as Wolf will lift into the area. Martinez stinging that first touch and taking the strike on the swivel, but easy work there for Celentano. Whipped into the area. Flick off from Buka was dangerous, and it was over from Kubo. There's a question coming into these playoffs. Have they beaten quality opposition enough? As O'Toole swings to the back post, Perea's header is onto the roof of the net. Reshano being harried there by Sands, but he turns around him and on he goes and pulled to the floor. And surely the yellow card shown there to James Sands, a first of the match shown to a city player. Options available from the bench should Pat Noonan want to change the look of that as Wobodo will loft in behind. Odeshano timing is run well. Odeshano in behind. Odeshano deflecting into that side netting. It will be a corner as it looked like Luke Odeshano had gone in behind. Assad recovering possession for Cincinnati. And Odeshano once more. NBA for Yuya Kubo. And Freeze getting a piece. A cost on the follow. And it's redirected in. Yamil. Assad gets FC Cincinnati off and running in these playoffs. Well, it's an excellent start to the second half for Cincinnati. Off and running, great intensity. Or Shano, Costa, everybody involved. But it's that little run right there from Kubo to get in a little separation, then to be able to play that ball across. There's a deflection. Acosta there to play it across. And Assad with an excellent finish, almost just hits his head to find its way into the back of the net and put the home team up 1-0. We get four players in. They're so dangerous when they can get in behind. Serve balls across the six-yard box. Left here for Oreshano to whip in at pace. Back post, Kubo's header down. Could still be available, but no one in Cincinnati blew able to get to it. City need a goal now. They turn to one of the best creators they've had in club history is Acosta. The lift to the back post. Robinson header across, and it's over from Hademi. Flag stayed down. As Cincinnati take off, sprinting beyond Risa. So good at 1v1s there, Oreshano. Driving into the area, cutting inside, Oreshano off the post! To win this ball, to allow for Oreshano, and just before this, it was a big touch to understanding. Left it there for Sands, and Parks can clear. A lot more purpose about both teams. As Perea drives into the area, and there's Perea! Right at Celentano, stung his palms, and he does well to tip over in the open field more threatening words in Major League Soccer. Acosta and Buka and Yamil Assad trying the curler, but the block in the way from Burke Risa has been busy in the center of that defense. Such a left-footed player. Now Buka back heel into Acosta, oh, back heel to oh. shuttle. That was sumptuous football. Santos joining the attack and Kubo with a good ball into him. Sergio Santos with four with him in the attack. Looks like he wants to try the strike and takes the strike on and plenty of power in it. Freeze down to his left too. Sit behind. Ahead of Awazim, he goes to ground and the referee is unmoved.
Celentano. And now a yellow card is going to come here for Maxi Morales for dissent, for his appeals, for that potential penalty. And yellow card shown towards Assad for delaying the restart. Can New York City create with a set piece? Fernandez whips in into the heart of that area. Wazi him away. Rodriguez just got underneath it. It looked like it had opened up for Santi Rodriguez. Couldn't control it. O'Toole. Won by a Wazi. Costa. And in behind. Here's a chance for Joe Aquini. Oh, it's wide. That looked like it was going to put the game to bed. Couldn't steer it on target. Morales. Fernandez will chip back in. Header won by Bacrar and Fernandez again going forward. It's away from Miles Robinson. Acosta in that aerial duel with Tavon Gray. It's a free kick as Acosta now going to ground. Fourth official Chris Penso stepping in. As Acosta has gone down. Oh, here it is again, and it's just excellent work from Acosta. Yeah, there's the there's the look, but and there yeah. it is. Yep, it is. What an incredible ending this would be if City can get an equalizer. Rodriguez delivers the flick on oh. through that penalty area, but Carr will chase it out the other side, and the full time whistle will go. What opportunities at the end of a chaotic game, but FC Cincinnati have taken game one of this best of three through a goal.